we're going to learn some terminology about networks and a lot of these are going to go pretty quick because it's just me defining some terms for you so that you know about them and the first one we're going to look at is uh categorizing networks by size we're looking at networks and networking terminology and uh, the first terms you should know about is when we categorize networks by size and those terms are pan lan wan and man and uh what what are those what are those so basically PAN stands for a personal area network, LAN stands for a local area network, MAN stands for a metropolitan area network, and a WAN is a wide area network. And, uh, and so these are just various categories by size from the very smallest to the widest. And uh, I've already talked about this a little bit in some of the other videos, but a personal area network would be like all of your personal devices communicating and connecting together. So an example of that is when I get in the truck with my wife's cell phone, my wife's cell phone via Bluetooth will connect with the car and because we've set it up to do it that way. And so when a call comes in, we can answer that call through the car, pressing a little button on the steering wheel, and uh, you hear it over the radio. So that would be an example of a personal area network. And if you look for a personal area network on Wikipedia, you get some other stuff. Bluetooth is one of the ways personal area networks connect. There are a few other standards or methods by which some devices might be enabled to connect with each other. And if it's a Bluetooth personal area network, it's also called a PicoNet, PicoNet. So if you sometimes hear that phrase, PicoNet, uh, that's what that stands for. That's just another personal area network. And one of the things that's kind of interesting with uh, technology and computers and everything is they're making clothes with LEDs for whatever, fun events, parties, costumes, things like that. And so you get outfits like, you know, this bikini with LED lights built into it. Or you could go to Google and search for LED clothing, and you could see examples of a clothing uh, made with LED lights built into it. Um, let me see. There's a few other cool examples here. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Anyhow, LED clothing. So that's uh, that's another <laughs> another thing. LANs would be a local area network. So that would be like within one location, all the devices, computers connected together. That would be referred to as a LAN. A wide area network would be a network between many different locations. So at State Center Community College District, we have a LAN at Fresno City College connecting everything at Fresno City College. But then within the district, we've got Fresno City College, we've got Reedley College, we've got the Oakhurst Center, we've got Willow and International Center, we've got the Madera Center. So we have all these different, you know, locations within the district. And when we connect all those different locations, that's considered a WAN, a wide area network. So the, the network at each location is a local area network. And then the network between all of the locations is a wide area network. That's how you categorize that by size. And, uh, and then finally, we have a MAN, and a MAN stands for, uh, in talking about networking, a MAN stands for Metropolitan Area Network. And a Metropolitan Area Network is a network that covers a metropolitan region. So some metropolitan regions have, you know, like Wi-Fi access enabled throughout the entire downtown area, and that would be considered a Metropolitan Area Network. It's covering the metropolitan area. All right, so those are some uh, terms for you about categorizing networks by size. Pan, LAN, WAN, and MAN. When you're out in the real world and not just talking tech with somebody, mostly what you'll hear about is a LAN and WAN. You'll hear about people referring to LANs and WANs. Uh, but increasingly so, you're starting to hear more about PANs, personal area networks. And uh, MANs, you never really hear about MANs. At least I don't. So those are, uh, those are the, the terms for categorizing networks by size. Thank you.